The Motor Spirit is in Pasadena for the Art Center College of Design Annual Classic Car Show. The Art Center was established in 1930 and opened its transportation department in 1948. It's become one of the world's top schools for car design. They have educated many famous designers who have designed many famous cars. Achieving mythical status in the car design world is Pete Brock. He joined GM's design department at 19 after Art Center, was Carroll Shelby's first employee, and designed the famous Cobra Daytona Coupe. He also designed this sports racer, and we pick up the on-the-field interview with him. Well, this came about because uh, Carroll Shelby had, had uh, won the 1963 uh, Professional Road Racing Championships with the Cobras, and uh, he was the first guy to start taking a European chassis and put an American V8 in the back end with the Coopers. So Carroll, uh, being tied in with Ford, did not have a, a big new V8 engine coming along. So he went to Alessandro Di Tommaso and said, can you take a small block Ford and make a 427 out of it? Which everybody does today, but at that time that hadn't been done. And Di Tommaso took on the job to do it and at the same time convinced him that he had a new chassis that was going to work well. So Carol had me go over and, and uh, design the thing for it in Italy, and that was probably the most fun I've ever had in designing a car was working with the Italians because uh, they are so passionate, the artisans over there, and you cannot believe the equipment that this car was built with, the crudest equipment you can imagine in the world. It was hammered out on tree stumps and, and big uh, square pieces of steel and formed all in wire form on it. It's all in my book, The Road to Modena, and it's probably the last of that era of cars that were really sculptural automobiles, and it was such a, a wonderful thing to work with the Italians at that time. Yeah. 